they played amazing in the second half. And uh, you know, that's, a, that's one of those things where you wish he was playing better in the second half than the first. You know, they started making a lot of shots and offensively uh, there was a lid on there for us early. We couldn't make a we couldn't make a basket. Um, and then the confidence just kept going and they just kept pouring it on. Especially knowing what was at stake for you guys. What was it like watching the scoreboard just tick out of control? Hmm. Uh, I mean, you pressed a little bit, man. You know, a lot of us pressed, you know, I think in the second half. Um, as they start making a run, you know, offense just got stalled. You know, it's our fault as players. You know, we have to continue to move the ball. And we didn't do it. We just we took contested shots, and um, I took a lot of them. And you know, it, it, you know, we just pressed a little bit. You know, you know, you feel it kind of slipping away, and you know, everybody wants to self-will it. You know, in a sense, and it's not always the best uh, medicine. It's hard to tell where the line is in this Eastern Conference playoff race and whether you still have a shot at that number eight or number seven seed. Is there a point where you'll decide, you know what, I'm going to shut it down? Well, we got three games left. <laughs> uh, that's, you know, so, you know, as long as you're still in, you still you gave yourself an opportunity. So, you know, we got another game um, on Saturday. So, you know, we'll see what we can do. We got a good team coming in. Uh, it's going to be like tonight when they're fighting for, you know, jockeying for position. Um, this evening, so you know we got to play a lot better than we did uh, for 48 minutes. Right, it feels like did the ghost start. I mean, you, huh? you, guys, you guys, a couple double-digit leads, but obviously got away for you guys to play. Mm. When that snowball started tonight, did those ghosts of those games start coming back? Do you think that added to the pressing a little bit? Um, no, I think it was just the you know it's just the moment. You know, everyone wants to win, man. Everyone wants to do well and play well, and you know we got off to a fast, a great start. You know, going into the break up 19, and then coming back and. They start hitting everything, and we start missing everything. Now you start pressing, you know, and everyone, you know, the whole team, no one is above it. And, uh, you know, then mistakes start piling on. So uh, I don't know if it was more so thinking about, you know, we've been in this position before, just more so the moment. And, um, you know, everyone wanted to self it a little bit, and uh, we couldn't do it. You've been on the good side of those runs. When you're on the bad side like this, is there ever a feeling of just helplessness that just nothing is? Helplessness? Um, I don't know. It just ain't a good feeling. You would hope something happened where it stops the bleeding, uh, but you know it didn't. When when Dragic hit that three, going, I think we called a timeout. I think we was down, nine, we was up nine at that point. You think, okay, you know, this opportunity, but they kept coming back for more. They kept pointing on, you know. So, like I said, you know, it was a tell of two halves, man. We played amazing in the first half, and they played even better in the second. Second half, second half, last game. Basically, four quarters of this game. You seem like you weren't really able to find a rhythm. Is it more defense?